Sometimes I wake up early in the morning To play my con 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 go Sometimes I wake up early in the morning To play my con 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 go Sometimes I wake up early in the morning To play my con 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 go Sometimes I wake up early in the morning To play my con 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 go Sometimes I wake up early in the morning To play my con 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 go Sometimes I wake up early in the morning To play my con 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 go Things up guys, welcome back to another video uh, I did do an intro before But I completely forgot to turn the microphone on so you couldn't hear what I was saying so I'll scrap that, record another intro now I did originally come in with my breakfast on the intro but now of course my breakfast has been demolished but yeah, here's what I had now I know this looks like a lot of vitamins but what a breakfast by the way, unbelievable but yeah, so we have the Velomir here which being a dialysis patient I have to take with every single meal so I take three of those with each meal that I have. I get my vitamins from Holland the Barrack, but of course you can go other places. I've got some vitamin C here, some joint care, glycosamine and chondroitin. Well, this isn't a vitamin, but it's just some uh, muscle balm for my injury at the moment. Some vitamin D here, very important. Some cod liver oil to keep that brain functioning. But firstly, Let's get into this breakfast. Comments, people saying that, you know, they're down, they're dumps, they can't do this, they can't do that. Don't believe that. Believe in better, believe you can get up, get out, still do what you love. Personally, I think how you start the day is so important. Get up early, washed out a cold shower, had my breakfast. And um, yeah, so start the day nice and fresh, nice and early. We're gonna head out, we're gonna head into town, we're gonna wash out some busking, have some fun and they come back for that. Let's go. Now, something that I've always struggled with is that feeling of when you get up early like I've done today and you head out, you want to get something done with your day, but you think to yourself constantly in the back of your mind, you're thinking, I've got dialysis later, I've got dialysis later, or if it's not dialysis, if it's another chronic illness that you've got to go to the hospital to get some treatment for, or you've got to be home at a certain time to, to do some home therapy. I think personally for me, getting up and getting out just helps me with that. I'm going to get out and do things now. And I'm not going to think about the fact that I've got dialysis later because I'm doing what I love now. So I'm going to get out, I'm going to enjoy myself. And then dialysis is just something I've got to do to keep doing what I love. And that's the best way to think about it, I think, you know, just use it as a as a motivating tool. Stay positive, guys. That's what I'm trying to get across in this video. So, yeah, on with the day. Busking life. This is
home now um, just finished washing my money sounds weird but every time I go busking come home and I wash the wash the funds uh, I haven't counted it yet but uh, we've got a fair few pound coins in there today the plan is I'm gonna set the dialysis machine up and then I'm going to uh, have a bit of downtime before going coaching that's another thing for anyone watching this that also does dialysis you can set your machine up and I think Every cent is different, so make sure you check with your nurse beforehand. But I'm allowed to leave my machine for six hours um, once it's set up before I can go on. So lots of the time I just set it up and I'll go, I'll go out and do my football coaching and then when I come back it's set up ready. Yeah, so there's lots of ways you can work it around your lifestyle. So don't feel like it just takes over. You can definitely, uh, you can definitely work it around your day to day. But time now to get me some of this Greg's. Mm. 
Hey guys, um, as you can see, I've just finished connecting to the machine. Football got cancelled, but I didn't get cancelled. We only had eight there tonight, so I'm the assistant coach, and it wasn't worth us having two coaches there for um, for eight lads. So I took the night off, which has been good because you know, it means I've um, stayed at home and just cracked on with dialysis. So I've got this going a bit earlier. I've got a bit of a horrible rash at the moment, so uh, you can probably see that in, the, in this shot. But what can you do, eh? So this is the machine here. In here, it filters through the time, how long you've got left, all the pressures to make sure Venus pressure, for instance, is Venus pressure there. Um, all different pressures. This is how much dialysate is going through the machine, which is the stuff which cleans the blood. This is how much fluid you're taking off. So I'm taking off 2.2 liters this evening. And this is the pump speed. This is 250. It starts at 200, goes to 250. And then once you're connected, which I am now, Pump that bad boy up to 300. Got some garlic bread, got some southern fried chicken, got some beans. But all you need is a Casio and these bad boys. And this is what you're going to get. We're going to start it slow, guys, and we're going to pick it up. Everybody just get a go. Yo. Can I get a yo yo? Yo yo. Can I get a yo yo yo? Yo yo yo. Can I get a yo 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 yo? Yo 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 yo. Yes! We're ready to go. Here we go. Here we go. But he's put Thursday Blessings Warriors. Uh, did not feel like doing my di my dialysis early this morning, so I'm actually just getting on the machine. When you do it at home, those are the options you have. Make today a great day. Remember, only you can do that. Your next chapter will, will be your best chapter. So I think that's a great message there, and also it kind of ties in with what I mentioned earlier. Doing dialysis is not fun. As Pedro has just put brilliantly there, make make the best out of it. You know, make today a great day, and. Um, and hopefully this video that I've done today is just giving you guys a little insight into what I do on the day today. I mean, of course we've been out today, we've done some busking, got up nice and early, started the day fresh. Don't let your circumstances define what you can and can't do, what you can and can't be or become. If you want to go out there and do something, just go out there and do it. I just love to get out and I love to get away from, from this, you know, I feel like I've got to do this. But um, So I remember one time I went out cycling. I went out cycling and just cleared my head. I had a great cycle, must have been about 10, 15 miles. And I come home and I've done dialysis, but as soon as I finished doing dialysis, I was like, I need to get out of this house again. So I got back on the bike and I went out again. I did like another five miles. And you know, it might not be the recommended thing to do from the doctor, but for me, it was just that, that freedom to say that I've done this now, but now I'm gonna go out and do what I wanna do. We should all um, take that approach, whether you're on dialysis or not. Do not let your circumstances in life, whatever they may be, health, wealth, whatever it is, don't let them define you. I think a lot of people look at the situation, look at the circumstance and they think, you can't do that, you can't do that, you can't go for a run, you can't cycle 20, 30 miles. And I think that because people put that kind of, they put that spin on it when you're not very well or when you've got a chronic illness or, or something's going on in your life, they put that spin on it and it kind of, it almost makes you feel a certain way and and that's what I see from a lot of patients and a lot of people are on dialysis when I look at these pages um, stay positive guys so thank you so much for watching guys thank you so much for watching if you got this far into the video you're an absolute legend um, I really appreciate it and please be sure to smash the subscribe button give this video a like and turn on notifications so you never miss a new video I'm gonna be posting new content every week uh, once or twice a week at least I really enjoy making them, so you know, if you enjoy watching them as much as I enjoy making them, that's a winning combination. But thank you so much, guys. Um, I'm going to chuck on some more, some more tunage from my busking session on the end of this video. So be sure to watch that and check out the other videos at the end. Click the subscribe button, which is going to be somewhere at the top, this corner on this corner, at the end of the video, and uh, I will see you guys on the next video.